Hello, and welcome to another series of Nature Notes. My name is Cassie Seer, and today we'll be talking about acorn apartments. Have you ever been in Chimiku Reserve and seen an acorn that has these tiny holes in them like this? That was no squirrel or chipmunk that did that. That was our friend the weevil. And no mermaid man, it is not evil. It is our friend the acorn weevil. Now the acorn weevil has this super awesome smell like an elephant to go up into oak trees in the early spring and summer and they'll attach on to green soft acorns and they'll plunge right into them like a mosquito and suck up a few nutrients but it'll actually spit out a few eggs into the acorns. Now they only usually do one or two so that the weevil larvae don't compete with each other so they'll fly around to a few other acorns to deposit its eggs. Once when the, weevil, once when the weevils have laid their eggs inside of the acorns They'll live inside the acorn all summer and eat all the nutrients inside. And then once when the acorns fall down onto the ground, it's time for the weevil larvae to eat, it, eat its way outside of the acorn. Now, I don't know if you've ever felt an acorn before, but they're rock hard. So they have to have super incredibly strong jaws to chew their way out. And as you can see in this picture, they're kind of fleshy and kind of soft looking. So they have to be very careful not to hurt themselves. Now this process, it can take up to three days for a weevil larvae to wiggle its way out of an acorn. So they sometimes make for easy pickings for mice and shrews. Once when the weevils have made their way out of the acorn, they look like this and they'll burrow their way into the ground and stay there over winter. Some weevil, some weevil larvae will stay in the ground for up to three years but some will hatch again in the spring and become adults and lay their eggs and continue the process again. Now I know what you're thinking, this might be damaging to the, the oak trees. Well, weevils don't actually hurt the oak trees, they only affect the acorns and the viable offspring. If there are too many weevils in one area, they can significantly damage the sapling population in the area. So one thing that we can do to help is to burn sites and allow wildfires to naturally take care of weevil populations. And fun fact for you foragers out there, if you're interested in hardening acorns, you can still take those weevils and fry them up in butter and have them as a little snack on the side. Yep. And that concludes my presentation about weevils and acorns. I hope you enjoyed.